Hey, it's Jeff Timberello with the Southwest Florida here to talk about the July 2019 Lee County, Florida foreclosure trend report. We had 87 mortgage related list pendants, which is down from the uh, previous year, but up slightly from the previous month. Really just not much to talk about there statistically. Same thing with certificates of title. Now this shows the deeds transferred via certificate of title. Now we, when we prepared this report, we download it from public records, we trend it with Excel, and we focus on two primary data points, uh, primarily on the list pendants, which shows what's coming. The certificates of title are actually what's coming. Uh, this is a deed that's transferred from the courthouse to either the lender or uh, someone who bought it, someone who outbid the judgment or the lender allowed them to uh, purchase it and didn't honor up to their judgment. This shows the certificate, certificates of title since January of 07, which is when we really started tracking this. Same thing, this is the deeds transferred since 15. This really shows the market normalizing and then this is pretty much the new normal, which is usually a term you never use, but it is the new normal right now. This shows the list pendants filing since January of 07. And then this shows it from 13, which is again the market normalizing and coming in. This chart is from 2015 forward. Uh, the, this is Hurricane Irma, uh, which disrupted and everybody stopped filing for at least 90 days. And then they continued filing and then it's normalized out again. This is by year originated. There's two essential bumps within the trend. There's four, five, and six which is split up between modifications and probates. And then there's 16 and 17. A lot of these are, uh, some 18 too, a lot of these are low money down, particularly in gated communities. And the market uh, from a pricing perspective hasn't appreciated enough for these primarily FHA loans to have enough equity to trade out. Uh, last payment date. Uh, doesn't appear to be they're sitting on much 05 from 17, but there wasn't, you know, that there was one really old one in there. And then the average complaint amount, not big dollar amounts, which the market has a large, would have a large appetite for cheap REOs. Notes essentially July is more of the same in relation to the foreclosure trend. Two of the foreclosure filings are a result of Bertrand versus U.S. Bank, meaning their uh, last payment was more than seven years ago. The lack of certificate of title growth in relation to the list pendant filings shows that the market has improved to the point that if you go into default, you can trade out. The institutionalized distress market, meaning banks, will not continue to be a primary driver. And most of the foreclosures are smaller loan amounts, which means there's a significant demand in those price points. So nothing here to be worried about. Uh, look forward to seeing you guys at a meeting. If this information is useful to you, uh, leave us a comment, like it, or share it. And if you know something we don't know, shoot me an email, jeff.swflreia at gmail.com. Thanks for watching. I look forward to seeing you in a meeting soon.